Hi everybody, this is Canty Smith, Director of Education at Telescience Museum. And helping me today is River and Isla. And we are going to make a lava lamp. Lava lamps were first made in 1960 and were originally made with colored wax and they would put them in a glass container with colored water and then they would heat them up over a very hot and bright light bulb and the wax would move throughout the water and it would look very cool. Uh, what we're going to do today is we are going to use our own kitchen materials and our own kitchen science as we make a lava lamp today. So we have a container, it can be plastic or glass, and River is now going to add to it uh, a half a cup of oil. And that should just about fill up halfway that container. Go ahead and pour that in there. And we know we're going to be a little messy, so we're going to do this outside. We got the whole thing in it. Excellent. Well done, River. And now Isla is going to add a half cup of water. Ooh, that's fun. Okay, and we can see, look at all those bubbles. Now, the next thing, what do you notice? about the layers in the jar. Isla, what do you notice? The water's on the bottom and the oils is on the top. So what does that mean, River? Uh, that means it's, uh, um, it's at the bottom. Uh, that the water is heavier. Yeah, the water's heavier and the oils not, uh, um. It's floating on top floating on top. Excellent. So it's separating pretty well right now. And right now what I'd like to have, um, River is going to put in four drops of his food coloring. What color is your food coloring, River? Blue. One, two, three, four. Oh, ho, that's good. And now Isla's going to add four drops of her food coloring. What color is yours, Isla? Green. Okay, drop that in there. One, Two, three, and four. Okay, oh, got another one in there, five. that's okay. And look at how pretty those colors are already. They're starting to kind of come out and you can see. Now I guess th uh, it's baking soda time. Yes, it is. So now we're gonna let that food coloring kind of sit just a little bit. And if we were allowed it to sit for a longer period of time, and I'm gonna put this behind it to see if it shows if the colors show up a little bit more. I think it does. So if you look at the colors, you can see that they're kind of in the bottom, some's on the top, but if we left it there for a long time, the food color would actually go on top of the water, but underneath the oil. And what we're getting ready to do now is, a, gosh, so much fun. And we're gonna each put in a tablet and you'll see we went and got some effervescent tablets and we only need a quarter and each uh, of them are going to, Isla and River, are going to drop in a quarter of a tablet into our container and watch what happens. Three, two, two one. one. Come on, go. And three, two, one. Ah, look at our bubbles. So we're kind of making our own lava lamp. And this will keep going for quite some time. It it's like it's a volcano eruption. Okay.